بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ان دس ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس ڈکلائننگ بیلنس ڈپریسیشن وی ول کیلکولیٹ بائی یوزنگ دا فارمولا ان ایکسل سو وی نیڈ دا انیشیل کاسٹ آف ایسٹ سپوز اٹس ہنڈریڈ تھاؤزینڈ دا پرچیز ویلیو آف دا ایسٹ سیلویج ویلیو آف دا ایسٹ ول بی ٹین تھاؤزینڈ اٹ از این ایسٹیمیٹیڈ ویلیو آف دا ایسٹ ایٹ دا اینڈ آف اٹس یوز فل لائف suppose we are going to get at the end of its useful life 10,000 value of life of asset suppose it is 10 years period of assets I have write in the series format because we will use the formula and we will use this series in calculation so let's start from the first year depreciation we need to active this cell and we need to go to formula bar go to financial tab and here you will find here DB click on db you will be having some arguments like cost salvage value life and period the month it's not matter if you will use or not it will not affect so the cost will be 100000 salvage value 10000 life 10 years period 1 click on okay and here you have the depreciation of first year if we will drag it down to the other years it will calculate automatically but the problem is we did not make the constant of these cells references how we can do that click on this active cell go to the formula bar and press f4 make the dollar sign to make it constant this value also salvage value make it constant this life make it constant we will not make constant this value the period because we want to move along with this 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 years so just we will enter we will leave this okay now if you hold from the corner and drag it to the end you will find the values here all the depreciation first year this much second year this much if you click on it you can see here our cell reference is moving it is not constant on one if you click on this you will see here our cell reference is moving this d6 as you remember that we did not make it constant here put the dollar signs now we need to calculate cumulative depreciation of assets cumulative depreciation of asset is the aggregate total of these all like first year the total was this second year total was the first year plus the second year enter the third year two years depreciation aggregation and plus the third year hold it from the corner and drag it to the end cool now we need to calculate the ending value of the assets after one year equal sign initial cost minus first year depreciation enter okay the first year ending balance of the assets after depreciation is 79400 now we need to make constant this cell reference as we need to drag it down the formula till the 10th year go to this formula bar and press f4 enter drag it down to the end cool let's check the logic behind declining balance depreciation method if you click on equal this reference cell minus sorry divide this equal this much percentage we will go to home under the numbers we will click on percentage same way equal we will see this divided by this value go to percentage and check a constant percentage of depreciation deduction applied on all the years let's check the percentage of depreciation now and equal 100 minus 79 percent so depreciation value is 21 percent suppose the first year depreciation was the initial cost is this multiply by 21 percent 20,600 
second year what will be the value the remaining value we need to take this value now the remaining value multiply by 21 percent so the second year 16,000 16,000 so the third year we need to take this remaining value because it is declining balance depreciation take this value multiply by 21 percent as you can see here 12,987 12,987 the same if you go to 8th year equal we need to take the balance of 7th year assets multiply by 21 percent enter 4098 as you can see it is 20,600 declining to 16,000 12,000 10,000 8,000 and at the 10th of the year it's 2584 thank you for watching this video i hope you like our videos please subscribe our channel for more videos